so uh, you played some games this past weekend. Yeah, we actually took uh, <laughs> two trips. Uh, well, you were gone, and I we'll get to what you were doing. Yes. Because actually is interesting. Uh, I had a friend come over this weekend, and after getting feeling a little sick, I finally got to play uh, the last scenario in Lord of the Rings, which has a seven difficulty. Okay, from the of the LCG, yes, the base yes, game, correct, as well as uh, Doom Town, and I'm blanking on the other one. Uh, but anyways, oh no, we learned it. That's why I'm just confused. Okay. I, I thought there's a third game. In that. <laughs> so I won't talk about the game I learned since we haven't really played it yet. So we'll get there. My comments. Yes, but uh, the Lord of the Rings one we actually had to do twice because we lost very hard, very quick. Okay, it definitely was one of those things. Like we ended the game. Uh, if anyone hits fifty threat. Game ends. We ended it up both at 49th threat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like, it Kinda was close. Weird. And that included uh, my deck, which is based more on support, while his was more the fighting one. Uh, lowering our, th our combined, together combined threat of lowering it to 17. Not 17 each, but a total of yeah. 17. It was just the two of you? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it was very difficult, but it was really fun because it's cooperative, so difficult works really well there. Mm -hmm. Pretty much uh, one of our team our heroes that we control were jailed so we had to save them and stuff and that's cool <laughs> then fight an, uh, I forgot what they're called like a Nazgul I think it was I think that's what they're called yeah, yeah. I wasn't sure if I was pronouncing it right or not but, <laughs> I, I, yeah we had to fight one of those then and stuff and we won we only won that final turn by killing the Nazgul with Gandalf I'm, that's how you do it <laughs> yeah no well yes cause <laughs> my friend's like you can't. Ki a human can't kill one, but he's not human, so I think we're good. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I still. I want to play it. I've only. I've played the board game. Yeah, version. I mean, I, next time, Mark. I'm pretty much Mark's bringing them all now, and I want you to try it out. He loves these LCGs. Yeah, no, he loves the LCGs. He's getting them all. He has that. <laughs> he has the Game of Thrones one. He both versions because he got the old one right before the new one was announced. Um, he has Doomtown, which we were playing his. And that, that's very exciting because we, we kind of, we were like, hey, <laughs> please play Doomtown because we want to play it and don't we know how. <laughs> yes, he learned how to do it. He made decks for all the groups, including the two new factions. That's pretty impressive. And that one we also played twice. Did he, does he have more than one base? Yes, he okay. has two bases. <laughs> okay. So we actually had to play with three boards. Oh. Yeah, we did. Yeah, it was really cool. Uh. It was just sort of funny because it's called the town square, but we had a town diamond, a triangle. <laughs> right. <laughs> but uh, the first game, I played Law Dogs for both of them, and he played the Eagle Wardens for both of them. The Eagle Wardens, actually, you, don't, you wouldn't know them. That's They're from a new one. Okay. For the, and for the, uh, my brother was the third player, and for the first game, he played the 108. They are the Kung Fu, like, China, mm. Chinese. Okay. <laughs> and he kicked our ass. Okay. He pretty much wiped both of us out on the first turn. <laughs> His first turn, like the, the, uh, the Kung Fu guys, their whole thing is they help, their cards have like Kung Fu 3, and you can play these Kung Fu cards, like up to 3 to buff them. Okay. And so you had this guy that had a large Kung Fu rating and a shotgun in the first turn. <laughs> so we pretty much just went around That's like really like beating, like beating, we were just like, okay, we lost. <laughs> So the second one, he switched to the Sloan game. If you haven't guessed, my brother likes to play the very aggressive. <laughs> he <characters>. likes blood. <laughs> yes. Um, and that one was, uh, well, it was funny because my brother was he's like, like, you guys are just turning like, and, that, and I'm like, well, yeah, that's because the one time I went up against you, you killed me <laughs> with like this character Mendoza who has this huge bullet rating. Uh -huh. Like, I, I'm the law dogs. I'm like, I'll get him to cheat. And Matt, every time I went up against him, he was able to do it without cheating. Like, get these huge hands. I'm like, you know what? No, we're not going against you. But in the end, I was able to somehow get a lot of money, get, like, this big guy out and take out his guys when he got them separated. And then we got to a point, like, no one's winning, right? And then we got the game. I'm like, you, uh, we thought my brother was winning because he had more locations. Okay. I'm like, oh, guys, I have three. And everyone's like, wait, you have three control points? Yeah. Uh, no one else has, everyone else has two influence. Will, Will, you won. I'm like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> so is, is it a, like, had you what, won for like multiple turns? No, you didn't know? no, it's like, an, I, <laughs> we started happened. a turn and we realized I won. Oh, okay. The okay. beginning of the turn of the game should have ended. <laughs> Which is nice because it was very late. We didn't, no, <laughs> we didn't realize. It's like, thank but God we can It stop. was a lot of fun to actually, you know, understand and play it. I'm very curious to know people's opinions because uh, he only has a few sets, really. Like the, I think the one for two, the two starter sets, and the one to make the 108 in uh, Chief Wardens. I don't think he has any of the uh, 
saddlebags. Mm. But when playing it, it just seemed that the 108 in particular just decimated. Like, they were just able to just walk in and destroy people. Mm. And these were all custom-made decks yes, that he made. Yes, he actually yeah. looked up online, like, some... Mm. As, as he said, the uh, cheap ones, because I think he found some other ones that required, like, $100 worth <laughs> more stuff. <laughs> That's okay. At yeah, this time. Need that. But, uh, yeah, and, you know, he wants to make every deck so he can bring the game and we can all play and just... Was that the... F- was that the first time you had tried playing with him, or you did? I thought maybe you did once before. I did once before, but that was more like me learning it again. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I'm still a little iffy on. Um, I think it's called Huckster and uh, Tech Maniac. Okay. How that rule? Those that's the rules that you and I keyword cannot find. Yeah, names that, that and keyword. stuff. Yeah. <laughs> but um, overall, it's much like it's nicer to understand, and it's very curious to see how differently because, like he mentioned, he played a lot more one v one. Mm. Before and then a three v three, how differently the game worked. Right, right. What do you mean a three player free for all? Yeah, versus okay. playing against just one other person. Right, 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 right. And how different groups do better or worse in sets. Yeah, no, I mean that can change things completely. And and it seems like it's different from like uh, like Ashes where you're kind of just like oh I'll attack you instead of him because in Doomtown you're actually like moving around. No, that's actually the really the big thing that happened. Uh, at least for me, that was a big problem. Is because I wanted to try to pretty much assassinate Matt's strongest character. <laughs> Matt, both times, and this is the thing that really annoyed, really made the issue with Matt. Ha- had equipment that pretty much gave him a guaranteed ace, like kill before the shootout started. <laughs> okay. So we so couldn't, like, <laughs> yeah, which is why we turtled in the second. Please stay away from me. <laughs> we just hid during the, <laughs> yeah. the most of it, and the only reason he probably, um, truthfully, probably the only reason he didn't win that game. Since I was playing law dogs, the law dogs have a huge amount of influence, so mm. they're very hard to beat. You mm. have to really get a lot of. I think I remember that because you played them a little other times. I happen to like really the law dogs. We I like being able to, to make people hurt for cheating. I really <laughs> do like that. I won't lie. You're a, you should be a cop, <laughs> or a, oh, no, 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 a board I like, game cop. I'm allowed to cheat. <laughs> <laughs> right. So are they. <laughs> That's what's great about it. But so. uh, yeah, it definitely is interesting to uh, finally get. You know, like, we wanted to play so much and finally get a chance to look at. Uh, I do really want to, because the one LCG he doesn't have that I have is... Netrunner? Yeah, that he hasn't played. I want to get see his opinion on that. Yeah. But uh, hopefully soon we'll actually have videos, maybe, in sometime in the future. And Jonathan, you'll actually get the chance of, the, like I said, the Game of Thrones. Someday. <laughs> the Lord of the Rings, and so on and so forth. <laughs>